What's up guys, thanks for tuning in. This week we are gonna to bring to you one of the best values we've ever found at a campground anywhere. In all the time we've been traveling, this place is probably by far the best value. So stay tuned. Now the campground we're talking about is John H. Moss Campground located in Shelby, North Carolina. Uh, the campground is actually run by the city of Kings Mountain. We were in site two. So our fifth wheel is 34 feet. We have plenty of room to get our fifth wheel in. Site number one right beside us was another really, really big site uh, lengthwise. Um, some of the sites are not 100% level. Um, may have to take a little work getting, getting your rig to level out in some of those sites. When you hear about the price, uh, having to do just a little bit of work to level it is not an issue at all. So the campground is gated. Um, the campground setup reminds us a lot of how the Army Corps of Engineers campgrounds are. There's a, a campground usually located right on a lake. Um, there was a dam right there uh, off to the side of the campground. So really had a, a real similar feel to an Army Corps of Engineers campground. Uh, there's a boat ramp just outside uh, of, the, of the campground. So process to check in was super simple, just check in at the office. Um, the gate does always stay closed, so they give you the gate code. You'll need that to get to, to get in uh, even throughout the day. They also have Wi-Fi there, which is something uh, a little unique. So the Wi-Fi was actually was actually very good. We were really surprised uh, how good the Wi-Fi was there. The campground also has a playground. Uh, each site has their own picnic table and fire ring. And then there's actually a walking trail that goes around the whole perimeter of the campground. Uh, and then you could even go out of the campground if you wanted to, uh, like we did. And you can walk down to the boat ramp um, and then back down uh, toward the entrance of the, of the park. So plenty of room to get out and walk and uh, not have to be in the road or in any high traffic areas. Like we said, the big, uh, the big thing here is the price. Uh, the sites are full hookup. And initially, uh, when we booked it, we, we thought it was a great deal at $20 a night, which is what we thought the price was. Uh, our stay was going to be for two weeks. Um, we had an event to take Dylan to over in Charlotte. It's only about 45 minutes away from Charlotte, so this was a perfect spot to stay. And uh, we were extremely happy at $20 a night. When we arrived, we realized that they have a weekly rate uh, that was posted on the door. And that weekly rate is $100 a week. So it's $100 for seven nights, full hookups. I mean, that is, uh, that's a phenomenal deal. And again, the campground, uh, the location, right on the lake, uh, just a, a really nice campground. Uh, not a ton of amenities, but it was well worth $100 a week. Uh, so we spent 200 bucks to stay there for two weeks, and we would absolutely go back there uh, if we were in the area for for any length of time. So they do have uh, some unique rules as far as how long you're allowed to stay at the campground. Uh, you can stay for two weeks in one site and then you're allowed to move to another site for two weeks. After that you have to leave for three days and then you can come back in and start your your stay again. Uh, so um, they do you know they do require you to move after that two weeks but uh, again I, I mean for the price it's really a very minor inconvenience, you know, if you're going to be in the area for any length of time uh, to have to move and be able to stay. So essentially you can stay for a month, but you would have to split that up over two sites. The Kings Mountain uh, Lake Patrol actually keeps their, uh, keeps their lake patrol boats right there down at the boat ramp. So there's always uh, kind of just a, just a general presence of, uh, of having the Kings Mountain Police Department there in the area. Uh, they did patrol through the campground a few times. Now, we absolutely enjoyed our stay there. And again, uh, if you have to travel, if you're traveling over to Asheville or you're traveling over to Charlotte, a um, little bit further to get to Asheville, but if you don't want to stay, you know, if you don't want to pay super expensive rates to stay over toward the Maggie Valley, uh, Waynesville area, then if you don't mind driving just a little bit further, then John H. Moss Campground over uh, in Shelby is an excellent choice. And then obviously going into Charlotte, you know, if you don't want to deal with uh, trying to find a spot right down in Charlotte or somewhere close, this is also an excellent campground for that as well. That's pretty much it. Um, again, probably the best value that we've ever found uh, in our almost five years of full-time RVing. So hope you found this video informative. Make sure to check out 
John H. Moss Campground if you're ever in the Shelby, North Carolina area. Thanks for watching, and we'll catch you guys down the road.